place. Hey, Mama. Hey, Thank you.
chiburi salur turar tu da da du del mana chama e chiburi salur turar tu da da du del mana chama Reach and 
paese mio che stai sulla collina disteso come un vecchio addormentato la noia, l'abbandono, il niente sono la tua malattia paese mio ti lascio io vado via che sarà, che sarà, che sarà che sarà della mia vita chi lo sa so far tutto o forse niente da domani se vedrà che sarà, sarà quello che sarà gli amici miei sono quasi tutti via e gli altri partiranno dopo me peccato perché stavo vedendo in loro compagnia ma tutto passa, tutto se ne va che sarà, che sarà, che sarà che sarà della mia vita chi lo sa con me porti alla chitarra e se la notte piangerò di una linea di paese suonerò amore mio ti bacio sulla bocca che fu la fonte del mio primo amore soltanto che ritornerò che sarà che sarà che sarà che sarà della mia vita chi lo sa con me porti alla chitarra se la notte piangerò di una niña di paese suonerò che sarà
70 miles south of Albarabello, above the instep of the boot, is the hill town of Krakow. Somehow, I feel this is the right place to end my journey. To me, it's come to represent the Old South, a parched landscape of hardship, fatalism, and plain bad luck. Five years ago, a leak in the village water main caused a landslide. No one was hurt, but a number of homes slid down the hill. Although most houses remained perfectly sound, in an excess of bureaucratic zeal, the whole town was condemned. Krakow's fate has continued to slip with those houses. Since the landslide, 90% of the population has left. Ten years ago, the main church was broken into and stripped bare. There had been no rain to speak of for over two years, but when it did come, a brief downpour washed away the road. And then one night, thieves spirited away the town's venerated stone cross. The former inhabitants of Krakow have been relocated in new, impersonal housing below the old town. There they live seemingly indifferent to their own history. Above them, the church, stippled with the patina of many centuries of devotion, falls prey to the elements and forgetfulness. But in the south, nothing is truly forgotten. Krakow has its own personal saint protector, San Vincenzo. It seems that early in the last century, a neighboring village felt it had a better claim on the saint's corpse. One night, they broke into the church, grabbed the saint, and headed for home. But halfway back, his body suddenly became so heavy it could be carried no further. At this point, the saint miraculously piped up saying, take me back to Krakow and give me some music and welcome. And once a year, this is what he gets. Beneath the colors and the monuments, the frescoes and the gilding of Italy lie the faith and strength of its people. These are the qualities that are immune to time and weather and intruders from other worlds. To talk about the color of Italy is, in the end, to talk about its people. spoke to long to return to the old town, but they do nothing about it. What hope is left them rests in San Vincenzo, their failed protector. But San Vincenzo has abandoned Krakow, 
His statue now merely skirts the old town before returning to the saint's new home, a tin hut dumped in the middle of the new town. Despite all that has happened here, Krakow remains a hauntingly beautiful place. And the continuing trust the villagers place in San Vincenzo has shown me the power of a faith that seems to be missing in my world. Let's hope San Vincenzo will someday coerce an unsuspecting millionaire, or even the state, to rebuild his native town. Then the life and color will be restored to this lovely...